been three months since I moved to the Philippines and today I want to show you what it's like on a normal day with friends where we kick back and just enjoy the surroundings around us. Now make sure you sit back and relax and enjoy the video. in total today our local friends and our other friend Sam who's also from the UK and yeah we're gonna go and explore things we've not explored yet in Cebu Island all right so we've got here and it is a uh, low tide which for a springs shouldn't really matter but it is um so we're just gonna go oh, to the waterfalls just fell over that's not good yeah it's probably not worth it is it waterfalls You okay? Dog food. You okay? What is it? It's dog food. Dog food. Is it food or is he sick? Sick. Oh. Oh, oh bless him. He's travel sick. He's travel sick. The dog was sick. This is what I thought the springs were going to be like, the ones that we went to earlier. But this is the bottom of the waterfall that we've just come along to have a little look at. And it's very, very cute. I just can't wait to get in right now, to be honest. The good thing about this waterfall is that it is a oh sorry I'm trying to get down it currently but it is owned it is owned by no one which means no tourists comes here and it is free to get inside. It's a little bit chilly though. So we are now about to go into a springs, a real springs. Paddy is showing us the way. Oh, oh! The tour guide. Oh, it's very pretty. Show us how it's done, Georgia. And then I gave you the video. Must be. He will jump. Go ahead. He will jump. <laughs> Definitely not a heat of a jump like that. No <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. hassle. <laughs> oh my god. That is not okay. Come on, Georgia. It's so clear today. 
looks like this sunset. Huh? This is not sunset. It's very annoying. But look how crazy that cloud looks. Yeah, it is. I want to go snorkeling. Is it crazy? Yeah. Crazy? <laughs> crazy? <laughs> crazy? So today me and Cameron have had to go to Cebu City because Cameron ate a burger yesterday or the day before and cracked his tooth. <laughs> Yeah, only me. I don't know how that happened. So yesterday though, I had some very bad problems in my stomach, which is still continuing today. So it's not the greatest day to be in the city. I've just taken some odium, so I'm hoping that'll fix me a little bit later. But I don't mind getting out of the province for a little bit, coming to the city now and then. This is Cameron's first time in the city, so we're going for a little explore. But yeah, a bit of civilization. Yeah. All right, so we have just come to Ayala with the shopping mall here, and we're going to check out the terrace. Ter Terraces. Terraces. <laughs> that was just the wrong thing then. <laughs> We've heard that this is like where a lot of tourists go and go to mingle in the evenings and stuff. So we're going to yeah. check it out during the day and see what it's like. See if there's anyone there. Yeah. Usually, I would actually go home from the city the same day, but I think we're planning on staying tonight because Billy's poorly. So <laughs> I don't think I'm going to be able to get the bus back anytime no, I don't soon. Think so. And if it's still bad tomorrow, I'll be getting a taxi home, I think. <laughs> so. And seven bits. Why am I still singing Christmas songs? Oh, there it is. TJ Ads. We have just found a pulling bear, which is that store just behind us there. <laughs> I went in, they didn't have my size, luckily, and the things that I wanted. Cameron, on the other hand. Oh, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> Found a top instantly. He did say, like... no, I'm not going in because I'll buy something. I and like all of their clothes. This thing. Now, I'm actually thinking I might go and get my hair cut because Ooh. it's uh, getting a bit mullety at the back. But yeah, I need to get this hair oh, cut. Yeah, right there. Oh, <laughs> 7,000 miles away and I still can't get away from London. <laughs> so I have just been into this hairdresser's to get my hair cut and I feel so much better because I was growing this mullet on the back of my head. And look now, it's gone. Me and Cameron are both going to get our hair cut. So Cameron's still getting his done. He's just sitting there in that chair. And he's getting his beard trimmed. Cameron's probably paying more than he usually would, but they're doing a good job it seems. Yeah, they're doing a really nice job. I was just giving it the sign of approval. But my hair is nice. I know I've got the bandana on still, but it's a really nice shape now. And I'm trying to grow my hair out. So I said to them, don't cut too much. I just want the mullet gone so we can grow into it as it goes. But I'm really liking my hairstyle now. It's a bit shorter, a bit more tucked in, and it's better for the heat. It just feels lighter. So I think I found my salon. Oh, and I also forgot to mention that it's 315 pesos to get my hair cut. That is the equivalent of about £4.75. So, yeah, really good deal. Goes 